Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new around here, my name's Jenny and I have a website called mybritneyspearscollection.com. In today's video, I'm showing you something slightly different. If you've seen my last video, I showed you the European CD single for I'm a Slave For You. I'll just show you briefly here as well. It had four tracks on it and track four was an interview with Britney. Now the interview questions are printed on the inlay of the CD, which I'll show you here, but the answers that Britney gave were actually all on track four. So if you listen to track four, on its own without the CD it doesn't make any sense because she's just answering questions that you never get to hear so what I've done in this video is I'm actually going to write down the questions for you here so you can see them and then you'll hear Brittany's answer to each question just before I go into the actual interview part I'll just remind you if you like seeing items like this out of my collection to subscribe and hit the bell it will give you a notification when my next video comes out and also I'm available on Patreon so if you want to help out my collection in any way I've got two starters here so there and I really do appreciate everybody who becomes a patron or even if you just subscribe any interaction with my channel is greatly appreciated so sit back and enjoy the interview questions from this I'm a slave for you CD enjoy really whatever I'm in the mood for I mean most of the time I'm just like a pair of jeans and some boots and a cute tank top. <laughs> I'm not very hard to please, you know, but um, like if I'm going to a nice event or something like that, I usually get, I like Dolce & Cabana. Um, I like this girl named Patricia Fields. She does a lot of stuff for Sex in the City too. Really, when I'm on tour and stuff, just nearly touring in the show every night really kind of keeps me in shape. And, but lately, since I've been recording and stuff, just I'll work out like for an hour once a day. And really, I have more energy if I do that, you know. I just feel better throughout the day. Oh, definitely. I love working out. I really do. Yeah. Actually, when I was younger and I was like 12 years old, I, um, I ran the aerobics class at the top of my dad's gym when I was like 12. So it's something, I, yeah, I think it's fun. I love it. I'm a Sagittarius, so I'm very active. <laughs> oh, I really, I don't look at myself like that as a role model, you know? I just try to, you know, I'm human just like everybody else and I make mistakes. Really, I just don't overeat and I just, you know, um, and once you get used to eating salads and stuff like that, you, you start having a required taste for it, you know? So I just try to eat what's good for me and, you know, and usually with what I do, I have to have so much energy, you know, um, with the shows and, you know, tour rehearsals and dance classes. I have more energy when I do eat healthy. I can't eat like a burger, you know, sometimes, you know, there's always a time and a place for a Big Mac, you know, but most of the time you try to, you know, do everything in moderation. Rules that I live my life by. Um, really, um, just be true to yourself and never doubt yourself. And always try to, whatever you believe in, try to believe it, like live by that day by day, you know? And just try to be the best person you can be. It went very well. I liked it. It was, it, it was different. It was very different from what I was used to. I'm used to being on tour and, you know, doing, being really confident on stage. And then all of a sudden I'm doing a movie. I'm like, oh, what am I doing? Can I do this? You know, but um, the cast and the crew that was with me, they made me feel really comfortable. And, um, and we did. It was cool. It was very cool. I loved it. I have to say, like, the first six months, everyone's like, oh, we're going to do a movie, you know, in, like, six months and, um, you know, get ready. And I was like, okay, whatever. Then two weeks before the movie, I was like, what? I'm, I'm, I'm like, the lead in this movie we're about to do. What am I thinking, you know? But I read the script and I got an acting coach with me. And <clears throat> then I got on the um, set and I was like, oh, this is it. Oh, this is, a, this is a breeze. This is totally cool, you know? So it was a lot of fun. It, didn't, it ended up being a blast. Uh, you know what? She definitely has the talent to do this, but I definitely I want her to be a kid and experience kid things right now. And in the future, if she still has that love for that, then definitely go for it, you know. But just watch out when she comes because she is going to take over the world. <laughs> she is Miss Thing and she knows it, so it's kind of scary. Yeah, yeah, she sings all the time. Like we had executive people over at the house the other day and um, from the record label and they were all having dinner and she brings them all to the bathroom and sings for them. I'm like, Jamie Leanne, like I would never do that when I was younger. I mean, I was confident, but never that confident. So she definitely loves the spotlight.
So there you go, that's the end of the interview. There's 10 tracks on there. As I said before, in the original video, the interview questions are very light, fashion, weight, her sister and the movie. Nothing hard hitting, but it is a Britney Spears CD. It's not hard hitting journalism. They're not going to put really tricky questions on here. This is meant for the fans once you bought the single, just a little bit more about Britney. And if you hear Britney at the time, obviously she would have been 19 going on 20 at this point. She is obviously lovely sounding and you see exactly why everybody fell in love with Britney because she's such a down to earth, honest girl and she still is. But yeah, so I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, give me a thumbs up, leave me a comment down below. Which question was your favourite? What questions? weren't your favourite just let me know down below in the comments as always I'm at mybritneyspearscollection.com and Jenny's Britney Collection on Instagram if you want to contact me there and until the next video take care bye guys